Yo, we me back to another episode of Minecraft Survival Games. Today we're playing on the map of Tuna Moon Base 9, and today is going to be a bit of a throwback Thursday episode because I'm going to be talking about my youngin' days back when I was younger. I don't have shaders because shaders on Moon Base 9 is the absolute worst, and I'm not going to put myself through that hell. Um, and when I mean it's the worst, I mean when you walk outside, since the map is just straight up flat and uh, the map is enclosed by black walls, the sun uh, is everywhere. You will see the sun everywhere, and it's quite annoying, and it's quite bright, so I'm not going to do that. But anyway, um, back in the day, I used to go to the carnival once a year with some of my good friends, and that's going to be the topic for today's episode, because we pulled off some shenanigans and stuff that I feel like would be funny for an episode. So, probably the most... Uh, the, the biggest thing that happened to us was we actually got kicked off of uh, the famous wheel. Um, I thought this was absolutely hilarious at the time. It's just as funny now. We were in the famous wheel, and when we got to the very top, um, and when I say we, it was me, my brother, and two um, of our friends. Um, we met the fam. These two kids were brothers, and we met their family uh, through church, so they were kind of church friends, and the four of us were really good friends and whatnot, and we still are to this day. And anyway, well, we're up at the top, we're like seven years old and stuff, and one of, the, one of my friends just spits over the side and it actually landed on the friggin' Coney's head. It was so funny. The Coney, and like, <laughs> Coney's who, the Coney's who the people that will get the Coneyville. And most, um, most Coney's are very, like, irritable. Like, they're pit, I mean, no one goes and becomes a Coney because that's what they want to be. They're usually sketchy people, and they aren't, like, the most mentally stable. And this guy friggin' lost it. And, uh, we got kicked off the ride for that. When he came down, he's like, Hey! He just, like, opened the door. He's like, Get out of the, get out of the fish wheel. I don't want to see you kids here for the rest of the night. And we're like, okay! Uh, and then we, we ran away and it was kind of funny. Um... So that was that. Um, some other stuff we did at the carnival. Um, I don't know about you guys, but did you guys ever, um, did you guys ever do the Hall of Mirrors thing? That thing was kind of cool. Um, like, it was, uh, it was, uh, it was like a hall, it was like this game type thing where you started and it was a maze of mirrors and you, like, couldn't tell if, and, like, everything looked the same, so you couldn't tell if something was a mirror or not, you had to, like, stick out your arms in each direction, um, and it was kind of like a grid pattern, and some, some sides had mirrors and some didn't, and you had to figure w your way out through the maze, and that was hard, but it was a lot of fun, like, you were seeing your reflection, like, hundred times and stuff, that was fun, I don't know if you guys did any of that stuff, um, okay, got that, um, I don't know if you guys ever, uh, um, did you guys ever try the BB gun game? My parents would never let me. But the conies who always worked there were always like, they all, they all, those were the conies that always wanted you to try their game. There was, like, the BB game basically outworked is you had a thing that looked like a gun. It, I mean, in actuality, it probably was an airsoft gun. Um, and what it did was, um, you shot metal BBs, um, at a target it was like a thin piece of paper like maybe a third of the size of an index code and it had a picture of a star on it and um you had a hundred bbs and you had to shoot out bbs you pellets like uh bullet point like metal they like metal bullets by the way that are round um you had to shoot out the entire star in a hundred shots or less and you won like one of those big stuffed animal things um and that kind of like hey Hey, hey, you should try the game. I'm like, oh, God, no. <laughs> and my parents didn't want me to play anyway, but, like, I was like, oh, God, not if you're running it. Like, the the Coney just, like, even if I wanted to, I wouldn't have done it with that Coney. I'll put it that way. Um, like, it didn't matter what my parents had said. Okay. Okay, got you. Oh, shoot. Okay, let's hope he doesn't tune around. Oh, who got him. GG10. So I just cleaned up house in here. 
So yeah, those were some of my favorite things back in the carnival. I'm trying. Oh my god! One time, okay, I've only gotten nauseous at the carnival one time, and it was this one ride. I will never forget this ish. Um, to this day, like my friends and I, sometimes uh, the the four of us, my brother and my those two friends, we bring it up. Um, the ride we call it the green bench ride. Holy Jesus, was the worst thing I've ever been on. Um. What happened was, there's like a giant pole in the center, and out of the pole there are four giant arms, and then out of each of the arms, um, the arms, the arms go straight out, and then they bend down toward the ground, and then as the arms bend down, four green benches come out from each arm, and as the, um, as the ride goes, the benches spin, as well as the arms spinning, as well as the pole spinning, but not all of them are rotating in the same direction. And oh my god, that thing slid us around. Like, um, we were kind of small, so like we slid around. And we called it the green bench ride because like that's where you were sitting in. And like you would slide around in the <laughs> green bench and stuff. Like it was not the safest thing I've ever been on. And this thing went fast. Like Jesus. And I remember like, it was like, whoa, whoa. Like, and like the force is like centrifugal, centrifugal or centripetal. One of those two words. The force, the centrip, get whatever word force. Um, it's it describes the force of like a circle. It kept constantly changing, and like it 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 made your head spin. That was it was so nauseating. And when we came off of that thing, I hope I described it well enough. Um. I hope I described it well enough. If I can find a picture of it, I'll put it online. It might not have the green bench. It, it might not have green benches, but like, if I can find it, I'll put a picture of it on the screen now. Um, it was horrible. Like, we were not able to do stuff for like the next hour because of that stuff. It was, it was horrible. Hmm. But at least I did it once. Okay. <laughs> so yeah, that, um trying to think um oh a lot of carnivals had this um it wasn't just like one or two that i've seen yeah i don't want i don't want to go in there if you there i'm gonna go around and make a uh diamond sword uh up in that tower um i don't know if you guys ever tried it the um they it, at this carnival it was called the fun slide basically you uh you took a potato sack at the bottom and you went up this long 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 staircase and then when you got to the top there was this giant slide that like had ridges it was a lot of fun, and like you'd race your buddies on that and stuff. That was fun. Um, it always kind of hurt your ass though. By the time you got to the end, I don't know. But a potato sack probably wasn't the best thing for that. I didn't mean to shoot that. Um, okay. We got in the baked potato. Um, let's go bang bang. Oh, I actually have a lot of flint and stuff. Let's tune a lot of these in it. Arrows, I guess. Um, do I need any gear? Not really. Um, I might as well just. Go ahead and do that. Um, okay. There we go. Um, so now we got all this stuff. I keep thinking that I'm getting phone messages when I'm not. I guess the light is catching my phone in a weird way. I don't know. Okay, let's try to take this guy out. You ain't gonna get me out this way, bud. No sorry, Bob. You go I'm going I'm leaving this building on my own accord. Um, because he could like flint steal me, he could fishing on me, he could do a lot of stuff right there that I would not like. Okay. Okay, the the fight is on. So yeah, those are just some throwbacks to the carnival. Let me know if any of you guys went on any of those rides. Um, the carnival I'm talking about, the one I went to, um, it's this thing in Dallas called. I mean, it's you know the big October fest that they have in Germany every year where Germans just get drunk all the time. Um, yeah, they had the carnival was like that. It was called October Fest and it came around every like mid September to October. Um, and, uh, I mean, like, I, of course I didn't get drunk, my parents probably didn't, I didn't know it, um, or at least, not drunk, but drank, like, you know what I mean? Um, okay, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, now, um, I mean, after last game, the last game I played was the holiday resort game. Okay, that guy can just keep running out of here. This is annoying. Okay. Check and... Oh, I was gonna say check and mate, but I missed the mate. Because, uh... 
Ah, oh, man. When I kill this guy, I'll say, mate, we gotta remember this guy's name. I think it's Haydaz. Okay, so as soon as we kill this guy, we gotta say, mate. Oh, my God. How are these missing? Really wish this guy... Uh, you know this guy's one hit, too. Like, he was decently low and stuff. Okay, I'm just not gonna fight this kid. This... People like this, this is just the most annoying stuff. Like, just hurry up and fight. Like, I don't care if you're low, just get it over with. Okay, but it is what it is, so let's just go this way. Um, I don't know. Are there any chests on top of you? Like, it seems like this would be an excellent location for a tier 2. Um, here we go. Okay, we got that. Oh, shoot. Hold on, wait, whoa, 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 buddy. Is that where, is that where the guy went? If he's in here, he's trapped. He can't leave. There's a guy over here. Why don't we, oh, why don't we just kill this guy? Um, is there, yeah, I can get him through over here. Um, let me know. I'm trying to think of some other carnival stuff. What are you trying to pull, bud? Um, I'm trying, what are some other carnival shenanigans we pulled back in the day? I don't know. I think getting kicked off the Ferris wheel was easily the highlight of, uh, my, my youth in terms of the carnival. Um, dang it, did I pass through this way? Okay, um, where is... Think we could get a kill right before deathmatch? Might not be the smartest plan, but we'll try it. Maybe we could at least get his health a bit low, you know? Nothing bad with that. Um, I've gotten a lot of kills this round, actually. I don't, I, I don't know about you guys, but I think I've gotten, like, five or six. Um, I killed at least, like, three or four people down here. Uh, no, no, I killed... I killed three. I killed three. There's the dude. Hopefully he doesn't see me within 10 seconds. Okay, don't make a noise. Dang it. Dang it, okay. Now, now I'm just gonna be wasting my airs if I go for him. That sucked. Okay, slash debug. I got six kills right in this game. Yeah, buddy. This guy knows what's up. Oh, no, you ain't teaming with me. He is looking me straight in the eye. Okay, let's go this way. Alright, so, so I, I need to act loyal to this teammate. I'm actually not going to backstab him yet. Okay, we got him. Real, uh, wasted all my friggin' AOs on that other thing. Let's go and make some more. I didn't even know I was out. I mean... Yeah, I didn't know I was out. I wasn't, like, trying to shoot more or whatever. See that guy? Oh, here's this guy. Yeah, I don't really care if the other guy wins. I just want this. I just want to be the guy who kills this guy. I hate this kid. Yeah, I don't have a rod. That's an. That's quite an. Oh, buddy, you got killed by a fire <laughs> death by fire. <laughs> okay. Um. So now this should be a pretty cinchy win. My math teacher always used to use that word cinchy, meaning easy. At least that's why I think. Oh, it's a cinch, and she would. I don't know if cinch is a word, but I know cinch is. And the win goes to MC with Liam. I didn't hear. There are the fireworks. I'm like, I didn't hear the fireworks. But then MC is just like, oh, sorry. And then they hit the fireworks button. So there we go. Two back to back wins. I'm on fire today. Um, hopefully you guys had. Hopefully you guys can tell me some carnival stories in the comments below. That'd be kind of cool. Let me know if you went in any, on any of the same rides that I went on. And other than that, guys, thank you for watching. Thanks for the See you guys next time. Peace.